I guess we're live. Uh, good morning, everyone. My goodness, it's been some time uh, since I've uh, made a video on YouTube. And I want to apologize. I know there's two ways of looking at it. And that's something I want to talk about here, too. There's two ways of looking at many things, multiple ways of looking at many things. But in this particular topic of my on and off consistency is uh, personally being a little vulnerable here. I've been going through a little bit, but a lot, I would say, actually internally externally you name it uh let's start with physical right my physical uh ailments and limitations uh, recent surgery i am making progress uh but for a guy who identifies himself his whole being and and just way of thinking and doing things right his philosophy the towel of iron all stemmed from uh exercising and being physically fit and because of my injuries uh, whether it be in military or just in life in general over time, it started to take a toll and impact my way of thinking and as well as performing. Now that I have a daughter, I'm a stay-at-home dad, and that's also been very, very difficult, something I've never imagined uh, being this difficult. You know, uh, you would think just feed baby, clean butt, you know, diaper change, give her what she wants and she'll leave you alone type deal. But no, there's so much more behind it. And it's like everyone you ask for assistance in terms of how to do or how to be as a parent always has their perspective on things. Like I said earlier, multiple ways of looking at it. And while some of them may be helpful and resonates with me, the rest of it is like, oh, man, you just don't get it, do you? Like you really don't understand. So I'd rather not bring it up or ask for advice I never care for that. What I care for at that point is like, hey, man, just hear me out. So I share that with you because if you are like me, if you're going through that, I want to share here and empathize here with all of you that I truly understand, man. I'm an ambitious person. I'm a forward person. And ever since she was born, uh, I had to slow that drive down. And on top of the injuries, I had to slow life in general down and you know, again, trying to do YouTube and trying to be consistent in making content, reflecting back, it's been so hard because I want quality work. I want, you know, attention to detail, laser-like focus, this this type of video, I want to do this. I want. I have so many things I want to do and I have it all like in a list lined up, but it's so hard to do. And what happens is anxiety starts to build up. And because of this anxiety, then comes the negative self-talk of damn, I should have done that, or man, I am slow, or man, I have no focus, man, I'm becoming a procrastinator, something I've never been is starting to take place. So again, now I've been reflecting a lot, you know, taking the time for myself to rehabilitate and think things through. And I do want to get back to work again with uh, clients and helping them also enhance their performances because everything I do, man, I start with myself. You know, I make sure I'm squared away. I make sure I'm there to the very, very best of my ability. I am there for the person who seeks out my assistance or my guidance. So that's why I have taken this time and be like, yo, let me just handle my business. Let me just recuperate. Let me gather my, my life in order. You know what I'm saying? Find that rhythm and momentum. And once things starts to uh, settle down or kind of ride smoothly is when I feel like I'll be most efficient at working again so anyway again the message here was mostly for you i'm reflecting and sharing that with all of you that i truly do understand how hard it might be that you're in a position in life that you may not want to be in or perhaps at a job that you're not satisfied in or the fact that you can't look for a job because you have your kids to watch or you don't want to spend another 20 grand a year for a babysitter you know what i'm saying or daycare it, it's tough I acknowledge that it is tough, but there is a way. And for, for you to figure out, I don't know you, right? I don't know where you're coming from, but for you to figure out that direction of things, like what you want to do, it is so important that you let it all out. Let it out. The good feelings and the bad feelings, let it all out. Have it all clear for you to see objectively and tackle each of them. Like, hey, I want more of this in my life. Hey, I want less of this in my life. So that way things could start aligning and that way you can continue flowing forward as life had intended it for you. 
That's all for this video, guys. I truly hope that you are all doing well and are achieving great things. I look forward to seeing you in the next one. But as always, train intentionally with maximum effort and be one with the iron.